Hello everyone, this is Ashish Brahman from Rice Bangladesh. So um, today we are going to learn about the PHP. So PHP means the hyper preprocessing uh, preprocessors text. So by that you can connecting database, edit, modify any post from the server, uh, controlling user platform, controlling the My MySQL server controlling the user interface and collecting data from the MySQL database then collecting the Ethernet in data so for the PHP you have to must learn HTML, CSS and JavaScript so today we are going to see what we need to do so I have buy a demo domain for you this is called ebooster.com this is the demo domain for you sorry for the out noise <coughs> so I have a demo domain for you that's called ebooster.com uh, I will give you the root access of this domain so you can go here and practice your uh, fix all thing so, so we are going to get the file manager after that going to file manager so we are going to upload something so one thing is we have um, try the HTML so we know that for the HTML we have a extension called dot uh, HTML or HTM for the CSS we have used the dot CSS extension for JavaScript we have used the dot js extension so for php we will use dot uh, index dot php extension so let's start it with the php extension so we are going to create a file from here i am creating index dot php and create here so that means the i have create a file of PHP. So one thing you have, you should know that um, browser cannot read the PHP. It will read only the HTML. And when you type in PHP, it will be show you in HTML. So let's try. So let's get some coding in here. Just like I have start with the HTML. called doctor html so i'm inserting the data from here closing data in here making head in here making body in here So now we are going to create a PHP called Hello World. So for the PHP, for PHP starting, we start get at them question mark PHP and close with question mark like them. Okay, this is the starting of PHP. Just like I am using starting PHP. Closing, closing, PHP. Okay, let me get this down. <coughs> Sorry. So here is the PHP starting and stopping. Now we will write hello world okay so php have the extension called echo or print these two extension to provide the text uh, sorry to prov uh, print out the text in the browser so we will use the echo okay so let's type echo semicolon 
Hello. Wow. Don't forget to give the semicolon. This is very important in the PHP and C programming. Uh, if you miss out the semicolon in the PC programming and PHP, they will give you the shortly or error. Right? So you have to must remember after the text finish, you have to give the semicolon. Okay? Then keep saying. Then reload. You can see. Uh, I have used the uh, uh, command code which are not supporting in PHP. So we are going to close it. PHP support this. PHP support this command code. Sorry for that. We don't need this command code right now. So here is the hello world. So let's see the source code. Um, in the source code, we have used the PHP and tell tell the PHP that echo print out the hello world in the browser. So PHP print out the hello world in the browser by using echo. And when we uh, in the first, I have said that <coughs> browser can't read the PHP code. So when I go, go to the source code, browser unable to show me the PHP code which I use, the PHP and uh, question mark and echo. They are showing as a normal HTML. Okay, so we should give a title uh, you know the HTML coding there is a title extension so this is my first PHP using title extension so now reloading reloading see that's too much easy to print out the hello world so uh, very people comment me or message me that uh, if I make the not short video for the tutorial it will be great for your learning so I am making the short video so uh, I am making a page uh, and I am giving the link in the uh, comment uh, in the box uh, description box uh, please sign up that link and I will mail you the active access of the ebooster broadcom so you can practice on there okay so till then goodbye